Hello, this is Ryan Lohner, and this is my response to the first week of the Gaming and Libraries class. I'm responding to uh, the board game discussion because, it, as I mentioned on the message board, uh, one board game that I think could really work well in libraries is Stratego. It was invented in the early 20th century in Europe, uh, and uh, uh, it's a war-based game and got kind of a step up from chess. Now, I really like playing chess, but I can see how it might seem kind of boring to the like younger generation today. And Stratego kind of fixes some of the problems that they may have with it. It feels much more like you're actually a general commanding forces on a battlefield for two reasons. One is that while there is a designated area for you to set up all your pieces in, you can set them up in any real configuration inside that area. And also, they're only painted... It's only painted what each piece is on one side, so at the start of the game you have no idea where any of your opponent's pieces are. And you have to kind of figure that out, or at least try to, by like trying to realize how good they are at the game and watch how they move all their pieces to try to find out which ones are the higher ranked pieces that can, or which one of the lower ranks that you can attack with your higher ranked pieces. And this uh, kind of thing uh, can probably uh, get a lot of uh, new uh, young people into the library uh, just uh, for curiosity's sake as to this uh, game that could uh, seem like a lot of fun over uh, some other uh, games that are out there now uh, that are more popular. And... Uh, they uh, will, and it's very intellectually stimulating, and because it takes a lot of strategy to just try to figure out uh, where all your opponent's pieces are. But then uh, they will uh, just uh, try to form their own little groups based on who they feel they can make a good matches against, and uh, they try to give each other tips. Uh, and you'll soon find yourself, uh, hopefully, with a big like little mini community developing around this game and you can just build on it from there to get them to take advantage of it. some of the other sections of the library that you they might start to feel at first like they could have a better grasp of what's going on in the game if they do they like read some books about potential strategies to it which could lead them to a more using more of what the library has to offer. So uh, that's my response to the first week, why I think this game, Stratego, could be a good addition to a library or maybe even a starting off point to a bigger gaming program. Um, see you next week.